suck your phone. Anyways, hello. Uh, this is Criminal Juice. Obviously, you know that's my name because it says it on my subscribe thing. Anyways, uh, this is my first uh, YouTube vlog or something. I have the worst camera angle, as you can see. Uh, I was trying to put it in front of my TV, and it started uh, moving around and stuff like that. Who gives a crap? Either way you look at it. Uh, let me just say my intro. This is Criminal Juice for the blind. That's why I'm saying it out loud. For the deaf, that's why I'm giving you sign language. You can see my beautiful shutting lips saying it as well. For those that actually have eyeballs, I work with us including glasses, by focus or monocles, you got damn librarians. You can look into my crotch area, go through my pubic hair for us, keep searching, keep searching. There you'll find my name on my desktop right down the bottom. Can you read that nose? Okay, three simple. I get to each other to read. All you gotta do is ask. Anyways, um, basically, goodbye, Twitch. And I'm not saying goodbye, Twitch, forever. I'm not saying. Oh, Twitch, I hate you, man. No more, no more streaming. No more. Maybe two times a week. And that's only so I can upload. And I'm going to make sure that when I do stream, it's only two to three hours. No more of that piece of shit place. And I'm not saying, well, Twitch is kind of a piece of shit. I'm not going to fucking lie. It's not like it's not garbage or something like that. It's pretty garbage. It's pretty, uh, it's over the top TOS. Uh, there's too much stupid shit going on where it's just annoying to be on there. And then I always have to wash my mouth because I'm like, oh, ah, make sure you don't say retard. It's not like I'm actually making fun of retards across the world. It's just something you say, you know, to this or autism. You know what I mean? I literally just bought an autism light bulb. So as you can see, I'm representing myself. This is actually Philip's autism light bulb. You're like, what the fuck does that even mean? Hold on, let me give you the proof. Look, exactly, look. This is the light bulb thing, and look at what it says right there. Autism speaks, as you can see. So I know you were like, what the fuck is that? Anyways, don't buy that light bulb, by the way. I, I wanted to buy that light bulb so that my room could look nice and beautiful at nighttime. And then when I turned it on, it was the shittiest light bulb of all time. Do not buy a light bulb from Home Depot. It's complete garbage. Anyhow, the whole reason I'm just going to start making vlogs now, talking about different topics, but the one topic I'm going to talk about a lot is for people that want to stream, streamers out there, I want to tell you the stuff that you shouldn't do, <laughs> all the stuff that I've learned over two years, the stuff that you shouldn't do and waste your time on. And the stuff that you should try doing, which is the stuff I'm trying to do right now. Basically, what I'm going to start doing is sucking your cock. No, that's not what I... All right. Sometimes I need to be more professional. And all I ever think about is sucking someone's cock and, you know, eating someone's clit. But uh, anyways, technically a clit is a cock, by the way, if you think about it. When girls take steroids... Their clits turn extremely big. And then when they protrude it out like that with their fingers and you look at it, it literally looks like a dick. So technically, everybody is gay. Even if you think you're not gay, if you ever ate a vagina, you're actually gay because you suck the small dick. I don't know why I can't keep on topic. Anyway, I don't know what's wrong with me. Anyways, so basically, here it goes. Uh, I started streaming on Twitch. And I'm like, yay, yay. <laughs> Twitch, this is so cool. And it is cool. It's fucking awesome. Nothing is better than meeting a bunch of new people all over the world. You never know who's going to come into your stream, say hello. And I've met a lot of people. Uh, you know, I met a whole bunch of people. I streamed for a long time on Twitch. It was all right. It's pretty cool. <laughs> you guys know the ones that are still around to this day. You know who the fuck you are. I don't even have to say your name. The actual supportive people out there that have supported me till this day. Awesome. But here's the thing about Twitch, which is a big problem. It's, it's extremely oversaturated. Way too many fucking streamers out there. Literally, the way you can even grow on that shit is... Here's how you grow on Twitch. It's either you know somebody. <laughs> it's either you suck... It's either you leech someone, like if you're Miskiff or something, you know, so Miskiff, good job, by the way. But anyways, you got to be the most amazing leech of all time. You got to know someone to help you out. Or you just got to have a big background from YouTube already, or you got to be in like, 
like pro gaming league, something like that uh, will, will get you like a really big following or at least a decent following. I've been streaming for two years. I've been giving it a lot of my time. I did YouTube live streaming a little bit too. I gave it a lot of my time and everybody knows you can hate me even though the only reason you hate me is because you want to date me. Uh, but anyways, um, you can hate me all you want. You came to my stream before. You could talk all the shit you want. But there was a reason why you were on my stream at some point in time. Okay? You know I give 100%. And I never, ever stop talking. I always engage the audience. Um, my energy is always high. My armpits are always dirty because I haven't washed this shirt in 30 days, which... I'm always going to do vlogs in this shirt. Unless I'm outside, that's a different story. I cannot take this shirt outside. It smells like piss. Literally, the bottom of this, is, it smells like actual piss. But anyways, um, I give 100%. You don't believe me? Go look at any one of my videos. Go look at any one of the 600 videos that I put up. Hours and hours and hours of my time. Always energized. Always giving up 100%. Like just Even if I feel extremely bad, I'm still always trying to engage and that's the best thing you could do as a streamer is engage the audience. Always talk. Even if there's nobody there, just talk because there could be someone secretly lurking. Ooh, he's cute, but he's really quiet. I don't want to... Anyways, you, so engaging, doing all that. I do everything a streamer is supposed to do. The problem is, and it's a big problem, I don't know if this is a new thing or if back then people were different, but you'll get a lot of fucking people that don't even give a crap to support you whatsoever. All I've ever asked was, listen, this is how the this is how it works on Twitch. One day I can have 10 viewers, right? And I'm surprised if I have 10 viewers because a lot of people don't even, yeah, whatever. Uh, I, I, if I can, I can have 10 people watching me, right? <clears throat> Barely any, whatever, blah, blah, blah. And I don't see a lot of people that supposedly support me, right? The next day, someone can either host me or for some reason, I just build up a bunch of people watching me, right? Like, let's say it jumps from 10 to fucking 25 or 30. Then you'll see a whole bunch of people that I haven't seen in months just coming to my stream like, Wow, criminal, you're doing pretty good. Look at your view count. I'm like, but I've always been doing pretty good. The only thing is, you don't respect me because of my view count, which in reality, the only way my view count would grow is if you would help me out. Yes, you, the person that talks shit about me, you, you know, the viewer. Isn't that weird how people support you and they're like, we love you, criminal. You're the best streamer ever. You're the best, but I'm definitely not going to support you. Definitely not going to support you, okay? I've had a person that watched me for one whole year. Was on my stream all the time, almost all the time. This person never, by the way, never subscribed to my Twitch, never donated. This person also had a full-time job, never gave me a penny. And I'm not saying, oh, but there's people that don't have money. First of all, she did work. Second of all, how can you watch someone for a whole entire year, watch hours and hours of their content and not even think to yourself, well, let me give them some free bits because guess what? Bits are actually free, especially in America. So there's no excuses. I get bits offline. Literally, I do five days of bit farming and I get like 1,500 fucking bits, which is like 15 bucks or whatever the hell. And I go into streamers things and I give them and I support them when I don't have money. I've donated. I've done whatever I can to support. And then this person literally disappears out of nowhere. You know what I'm saying? But I'm just letting you know there's a lot of people out there like that. Where they, they act like they support you. But all they ever do is make fun of you or go, oh, look at your view count. Look at this. Look at that. And I'm like, well, it's like that because you guys don't want to, you know, like help me out. You want me to all of a sudden become some big star and then you can come and go, we've always believed in you, criminal juice. You're the best. You're the absolute best. Can I get mod? Can I be a mod? Can I get mod? Can I be a mod? No, you cannot be a fucking mod, you idiot. You think I don't remember? 
You think my memory doesn't work? Well, it does. So, don't waste your time on Twitch. I say stream part-time if you want. Do a little streaming, but make sure you put 100% of your effort on other things like YouTube, which is why I am here on YouTube. A lot of people, I literally told everyone what I'm going to do recently, right? I'm like, okay, what I'm going to start doing is I'm not going to focus on uh, you, uh, Twitch anymore. It's too many hours. I don't want to do six, seven hours for what? That's way too much time. Don't get me wrong. I enjoy making people smile and stuff like that, but it just gets nowhere. I understand if people really, really wanted to see me grow and stuff, but in reality, they just want to be there every now and then to just talk shit about me. All I ever do is get either... <laughs> This is, this is, you you want to know what a typical day on my stream is? Uh, someone comes in and goes, Fuck you, fat ass. Fuck you, Arabic. Fuck you, blah, blah, blah. They just call me Arabic. Indian. They'll request a song of someone jerking off. I find that funny, though. I'm not going to lie. I don't mind trolls. But after a while... if you're And the funny part is a lot of these trolls don't even come into support. They literally will go to my stream for like... Two minutes, insult me, and leave my stream. If you're going to do that, can you at least at least stick by or something like that, you know, to help me grow? But no, that's not the case. So I'm going to stop wasting my fucking time on Twitch. I'm going to put all my energy into YouTube. Like I said, this is my first vlog. These are the things I'm going to be doing on YouTube. I will be doing vlogs like this, whether it's outside, however I feel. This is my introduction, I guess, whatever. I'm going to be doing this. I will be doing my real life song covers. The first time anyone's ever done this. If you don't know what the fuck are my real life song covers, go check them out. Just type in criminal juice cover or criminal juice song cover. No one's ever done it. If they're real life song covers, you're going to be amazed. Uh, it's just the most amazing shit in the world. Number three, I will be, I think, yeah, yeah. I'll be doing offline uh, Fucking video gameplay, like playthroughs of video games. I'm doing Hellblade at the moment. I did the playthrough yesterday. Uh, it was pretty fucking cool. Um, yeah, I did the playthrough yesterday. I don't even know what I'm thinking about. I'm literally like, what? What am I thinking about? Anyways, I did the playthrough. The, the playthrough yesterday, and it was pretty cool. Uh, I'm gonna do playthrough part two today, I believe. Yeah, so those three things I'm going to concentrate. Doing vlogs. Maybe doing some random stuff, I guess. Blah, blah, blah. So I want to do vlogs, the real life covers. And I'm going to do some offline. I finally fixed my recording stuff so I can, you know. Yeah, yeah. So And I'll still stream on Twitch maybe two times a week. Three times, maybe. I don't, think, I don't know about that. But to be honest with you, there's no reason for me to stay on Twitch. People are going to be like, well, how do you stream that much anymore? I'm like, You're, aren't you the person that says stream and then you don't even come? That's the other thing that I hate the most. But I don't want to talk about it now. Maybe I'll save that for another day or something like that. But anyways, there's just a lot of people out there that want me to do what they want me to do. And I'm just like, uh, I'm just going to do what I want to do. And that's it. Because in reality, the only person that 100% supports me is actually me. And that's all there is to it. But I will have to shout out, uh, see, there's this, there's this one guy that I have to say that's always been loyal and he's, and he's really awesome to me. He's the biggest OG. And I would have to say my boy, Go Glass. I got to give a shout out to Go Glass. Uh, even though he's into bestiality and I'm trying to get him to be better person. Um, I swear to God, if I ever catch you again, fucking a squirrel and killing it, you're, you're dead, buddy. And yes, that's actually what he did. He came out of jail recently. I put him in jail, but he's trying to get he's trying to get better. I, I hope he doesn't have sex with animals anymore. And if he does, you're going to jail. But put it this way, if I have if I had a hundred gold glasses, I would be the biggest streamer of all time. So my my goal is whatever the case is, just follow my heart and follow my soul. If I even have one. I, I guess I do because this body's moving by on its own, right? There has to be some energy plugged into me. Damn, 15 minutes already? That's a long vlog. Anyways, uh, I'll try to make them shorter, I guess. But 
Uh, yes, if I had like a hundred gold glasses, my stream would fucking explode all over your face like a hot gooey cum. But uh, that's not the case. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to build up on YouTube. I'm just going to make a bunch of content over and over. And guess what? Instead of putting six to eight fucking hours into Twitch. No, thank you. I could literally do two hours. Two hours of work in my fucking room or outside. I could make like fucking 10 videos. I could make like 10 fucking videos instead of doing 10 fucking hours in one day for no for nothing. It doesn't make sense. So, yeah, any of you streamers out there, make 100% sure that uh, you really, really get into um, YouTube. And also, please make sure that you know how to edit your videos or pay someone to edit your videos if you have the money. Or... You can edit them yourself, or please uh, post your 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 uh, clips on maybe live stream fails and stuff like that. Just make sure you do a lot of other work in other places. Don't put all your eggs in one penis into Twitch, okay? Don't just stream and think it's all good unless you have the lot the stars in the universe line up for you. That's another story, but that's a really big gamble. Make sure you do everything else. Uh, this is Criminal Juice, and uh, that was my first. <laughs> Did you like it? Raw and uncut, no editing. I like. I don't. I, I don't edit because I'm lazy and I suck at editing. Maybe one day, I can have an editor.